It's not getting any easier being a Jaguars fan right now. After losing to the Denver Broncos at home, the Jaguars will face the undefeated Arizona Cardinals this weekend at the bank. News for Jacks reporter Scott Johnson has been looking into the drama that seems to surround Urban Meyer, a national champion coach in college. The fans are unhappy and frustrated with the Jaguars. That's not unusual. But something that's sticking out this season is a lot of national animus toward head coach Urban Meyer. There are some reasons behind that. Even the most positive diehard Jags fans like David Mendenhall can't help but be blunt about disappointment so far in the Jags 0-2 start. And the fans were still with the team, but then towards the end it started to get a little bit uh, where everybody was getting frustrated. You know, it was the same things over and over, the same penalties. You know, it would look good and then we'd go back. So two steps forward, three steps back. Urban Meyer is doing something he's not accustomed to, facing the media today for a second straight week with a loss. You know, a lot of guys were here last year, start losing those games and this year start losing games and uh, I just want them to stick together because we're going to break this rock. We will break this rock. Look at this quote from one of the game announcers yesterday right after the game. There's a lot of vitriol out there for him and I think a lot of it is unfair and unjust. He's trying to establish himself out there as a rookie coach in the NFL. When you win games, typically you make a lot of enemies. People like to see you lose. News for Jack Sports reporter Jamal St. Cyr says there's frankly a lot of football people who are jealous of Meyer for his past success. And there are Gator and Ohio State fans who are not happy when he abruptly left their schools for health reasons. Do you think this sticks with him for a while? I think this will stick with him for a while. I think this is something that was there before he joined the NFL, and it's going to take a little while before it really wears off. And there have been a lot of national headlines about Urban Meyer. One from USA Today that essentially says, don't feel bad for Jags, Urban Meyer. This is what he wanted. Another from an outfit called 24-7 Sports that questions if Urban Meyer will still be here after the end of the season. I did reach out to the Jags on that. They say they don't comment on stories like that because there were no named sources in it. But they did point to Coach Meyer's comments last week that he's staying here to build a program downtown at the stadium. Scott Johnson, Channel 4, the local station. Thank you, Scott. And don't forget to check out the News 4 Jags newsletter. In today's edition, there's an article about what went right and what went wrong in yesterday's loss. You must be a News for Jacks insider to sign up. Just go to newsforjacks.com and click on newsletters.